Here comes the field for the third. Super Effective Wagering, 10 and no changes. One, Bring a Little Jingle, owned by George James, driven by David Miller. Two, Lanny's Flight, owned by Larry Lane with Ty Van Roden. Three is Brandy Shane, owned by S.O. Hathaway with Jack Daly. Four, Towner's Tootsie, owned by James Foley. Hugh Beatty will be aboard. Five is Memories of Kate, owned by Mike Metters. Allen and Peggy Dupler with Brad Hanners. Six is Hello, Ashley, owned by Kim Patterson with Don Feaster. Seven is Tickle Me Wick, owned and driven by Roy Burns. Eight, Skip Along Patty, owned by Gary Risco with David Majeski. Nine, HR's Line Dancer, owned by Lois and Garth Brooks with Jeff Fout. And number 10, Noble Bikini, owned by Sue Curtis. Darren Mauser will be in the sulky. Phillies and Mares for the third, first of two Super Effectus. Six minutes till post time. Field for tonight's third race at the gate and moving through the clubhouse turn. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're off and pacing. Memories of Kate takes the lead. HR's line dancer is on the move on the far outside. Bring a little jingle quickly on the rail as the three favorites kick out for the lead. Around the top turn, Brandy Shane, the Niners on a break. HR's line dancer is doing the Texas two step as they move into the quarter mile pole. Memories of Kate has the lead. Bring a little jingle is going to come over to take her on. Next in line, Brandy Shane out of the second tier, Noble Bikini. After that comes Lanny's flight to fifth. Towner's Tootsie is next. Hello, Ashley, Tickle Me Wick. Skip along, Patty, and the breaker, HR's line dancer. As they move off that quarter mile pole in 29 and 3, racing past the stands. Bring a little jingle for David Miller. Leads well in hand right now. Memories of Kate shuffle back to the pocket. Around the clubhouse turn, Brandy Shane to third. Noble Bikini skims the pylons fourth. Lanny's flight along the inside. Moving up from between horses, Towner's Tootsie as the outer tier forms. Here's Tickle Me Wick. She's underway. Saving ground, skip along Patty. Hello, Ashley. Shuffle back ninth. HR's Dancer, tenth. A minute flat for the half. Less than three eighths of a mile to pace. Bring a little jingle. Has the lead by ahead. Noble Bikini's on the move. Noble Bikini up on the outside, leads by a head bob. Right alongside in second, bring a little jingle. Bring it up on the far outside, Towner's Tootsie third. Waiting for the passing lane, Memories of Kate. Bring it up on the far outside, Tickle Me Wick. Nowhere to go for Brandy Shane. Lanny's flight comes to the far outside. By three quarters and one thirty and two. Favorite quickly gives way from the outside. Here comes Towner's Tootsie up to challenge Noble Bikini. They're into the stretch. From the outside, it's Towner's Tootsie now getting lit and quickly drawing clear. She's jogging. It's Towner's Tootsie on top. Under the whip and no match, Noble Bikini. Towner's Tootsie to the wire. Noble Bikini second. Memories of Kate third, seven. Tickle Me Wick fourth. Result of tonight's third race is now official. The reverse highway patrol, 410 exactum, 152.80. 152.80. Super effect, the good one, 74, 63.80. The dollar box, 37, 31, 90. Post time in 14 minutes at 8.38. In the winner's circle is Towner's Tootsie. A four year old Bay Mare by Towner's Big Guy out of Pocono Tootsie. Owned and trained in Galena, Ohio by Jim Foley. Given a well judged drive tonight by Hugh Beatty Jr. Covering the mile in two minutes flat. Number four, Towner's Tootsie, the winner. Tonight's fourth race, sponsored by Steeplechase Village Luxury Reynolds. $10,000 final two series event number six for Ohio sired three and four year old trotters. Should be a good one, field of nine. Mighty Bloom and active Jim face off in 13 minutes. <laughs> 